I had the, I would have to face him. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm mad. <laughs> Alright, well here we go. PS2 is this. Do you want to eat this Mega Smash? Damn. I hope that picked up in the mic. That was hilarious. I think it did. I think the movie that I'm just gonna lean over here and talk with yours. Okay, so we got um, Big Sauce. He's going Pac Man instead of Steve. We saw him play Steve earlier. Two uh, good results against Arable Land. Um, this, this matchup itself is kind of interesting where MDHM is gonna be looking desperately for that one in. And then when he gets the in, he's gonna get the damage. Not quite able to follow, find the follow up with the knee. I guess for like Big Sauce, it's one of those things where it's like, it's one of those matchups where if you could frustrate the Captain Falcon enough, you might be able to force them to do an approach that they shouldn't be doing, and you can hit them. Oh, like that was a very good catch with the F smash there on the side B, and Big Sauce taking the first stock, trying to read the air dodge in to get him with the up smash, but he doesn't quite get it. Oh, able to get the back air, but good tech there. That puts Big Sauce in advantage, and he's getting a decent amount of damage. He's starting to move on him. All right. Oh, not able to catch up on the side B. It has like that little bit near the end that's still kind of hard to catch. He just wasn't able to space it quite right. He is taking a ton of damage. MDHM just struggling to find the end. Oh, gets him with the up B though, but he beautiful DI to the corner. That up B still not killing. It's sending him across the other side of the stage. What do you do? Oh, he whiffs it that time. He gets punished for it with an F smash. Good job getting out of the way there by Big Sauce, and he's up two stocks right now. Like, I want to say he's one good touch, but he needs a specific kill, like, move to land, and he's struggling to find it. That up B's probably been the closest thing he's been able to find, but even those weren't killing due to the positioning. Oh, but that falling back air there, catching him, focusing on the Hydrant, but with a 50%, 8% uh, already taken, it's going to be a little hard for him to get it back, and that's been climbing. He was wobbling him there. All right, well, here's the start of something, keeping the pressure up with those up airs. Oh, catching him with a little tricky stuff. That would actually stay really close to him. Oh, getting him with the back air at the Hydrant. It extended the hitbox, and he is down. That is game one for Big Sock. Both players in agreement that this was, in fact, a hot set. <laughs> you should switch to the between matches one real quick just so they can see. Okay. Essentially, Big Sauce just he asked MDHM for his glasses, took his glasses, then looked at the stage list, and then he gave it back. Can I miss a coach real quick? Yeah. Hey, um, yeah. <laughs> What's up? Um, I was gonna say maybe Battlefield. Why Little Mac? Hold on. FD, FD, go to FD. Please take me to FD. I was gonna say go to Battlefield or something. He's got a battle here. He's going to have to be playing. He said yes. I didn't say yes. I just said yes. Yes. Yes, sir. This is a reminder we are at Vortex Smash on today's date, the 24th of November. And we are going into game two. The people have decided MDHM should go to FD. And we are hoping to see him do a little bit better on this run through. Not quite able to get out of that F Smash. He does win back advantage on stage as both players are set back to neutral. Ooh, whip on the, on the uh, tilt there. I think, I think this might also be an upset if this Big Sauce does get the win here. Um, he was seated just low enough to be oh, within the, uh, the knee. Just within the round one kind of section. And MBHM was one of the higher seeds that was waiting with a buy. But if he gets this, this would be a very big win for him. Down a stock right now, but he's slowly racking that damage back up. 
Falcon with the bells, what will he do? He does the F smash with it. Oh, and the pressure there with the dare. And this is looking quite different from the last game. It looks like the FD pick was actually pretty good. He's smothering out um, any of Big Sauce's uh, setups and approaches. And he's able to really get a lot with the lack of geometry that's here. And just finding some good situations and just an advantage that's really helping MDHM just kind of prosper here. That doesn't quite set him up yet. Big Sauce trying to just set up a little bit of something. That should be a back throw. Gets as much pummel as he can. And yeah. he can try to match out of it. Cool. That'll take the stock. Yep. Alright, 50% and counting right now for Big Sauce. All that dare. The first hit a dare and a dare. I don't think he could have made it back from that. So You should ban big stages. <laughs> Squeaky clean, yeah, there really is. It was, that was a clean one right there. All right, so the bans are Battlefield and Smashville. He is not letting him go back to PS4. <laughs> you know, it's in the rules for a reason. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Okay, yeah, so we have modified DSR. Yeah. Essentially, you can't go to the last stage you won on in a best of five set if you, um, if you're going for your second counter pick. I don't like Smash Bros. Did you beat How did Louis keep by? What? Uh, yeah. Oh, Louis, he's in Louis right now. How about Louis he play? Oh, he plays Louis. Oh, uh, fuck. Yeah. Um, <laughs> just, just really? Then check the pause next round. Uh, <laughs> Wait, can't you pick the music on Small Battlefield anyways? Yeah. yeah. Oh, no, no, I've been, I've been Battlefield. Regular small Battlefield. No, he said regular Battlefield, not Small Battlefield. Yeah, I know. Okay, you're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the commentator bias, at least. Yeah, <laughs> the commentator That sucks, I was gonna be the MDHM uh, bias one. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna be going to small battlefield. We got our music counter picks, and both players are about to be ready to game. Get the we're gonna a slight check in on the monitor, just getting into a nice coloration and brightness, and we're ready to go. All right. For the last game of this quarterfinal match. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> All right, here we go. Falcon on the left, Pac-Man on the right. NBHM just kind of waited for a second. Uh oh, no go. Yeah. No, he's not I'm glad to see the aerial drift is at least the same from all the other games. Yeah. Now he's lit. Oh! oh. <laughs> <laughs> what a you know I, I love way to I start the set. I love Smash Four. I love Two Stock. <laughs> Good job, everybody. What a way to start the game. <laughs> I can agree with that. All right, now we're actually getting into the game with two stocks now. Um, slight lead to MDHM percentage-wise, but he almost even it back out. I gotta go. All right. Go, go, go. All right, MDHM pulling out the up out of shield, just kind of set him into disadvantage and getting that percent up. One of those up, up Oh, we got him with the knee. One of those up uh, moves out of shield that is so disruptive. But that Falcon kick catching Big Toss unaware and takes the stock. Big Toss possibly on his last. Alright, MDHM gets the grab, not able to get the follow up. There's a platform. Oh my god, he just went for a hard read with that. Oh, just barely out of the way of the dare. MDHM just sharking, absolutely sharking him, getting those up airs. 84% now. Catching him with a key, he just, he just did it to him. Uh, he's still coming back, hitting him with the Nair. Not able to secure the stock there. He's got a bit more work to do. And he had the tech roll in red, it was just a little too close to him. Oh, 
able to get the <laughs> able to get the back air to the hydra. And he does. And he's done. And he's done.